Gracie is a little bit of a perfectionist like her mother. And when it came out, she was like, I thought the bird was supposed to be blue. And so she started to cry. The birthday balloon went flat for a minute. She just wanted everything to be perfect like her mom. This girl right here is six years old and her parents had just spent over $30,000 on her birthday party that she's at right now. And she is sitting here crying because the bird on her birthday cake is the wrong color. It is purple instead of blue. And for that reason, she is crying. Even though she has all of this crazy stuff surrounding her worth over $30,000, dollars she is sitting there crying because the bird is the wrong color now obviously i'm not gonna blame the kid here right she's crying it's whatever she's a kid the parents are the ones who like seriously need help why are they spending thirty thousand dollars on their six-year-old's birthday party and why have they raised her like this to where literally a single color difference in a bird could make her cry and ruin the whole entire thirty thousand dollars that they spent on her birthday party hello people well Welcome back to another episode of Dumb Internet. Today, we're taking a look at a show known as Outrageous Kid Parties. And in this specific Outrageous Kid Party, her parents spend over $30,000 on a fairy tale birthday party for their six year old daughter. I mean, literally, just wait until you guys see the present that they got for their kid who is six. It's literally ridiculous. But without any further ado, let's hop right into it. How how am I going to tell my husband about this grand party? Tell him what kind of party you want. A dragon. You want a dragon? Like the princess party. Yeah. So how how big do you want it? Just like the big party. Chicka chicka. Bro, this girl is clicking and snapping, asking for her expensive birthday party. She does not give a crap if her parents go bankrupt, if they lose the whole entire house over this birthday party, okay? This is very important to her. She needs dragons, princesses, fairies, you know, all of that. It's so important to her. But like, seriously, how are these parents gonna let this happen right now? She is six years old. She's not gonna remember a single thing from any of this. Like, I really don't understand how they're actually gonna sit here and spend thirty thousand dollars on a birthday party that she will not remember at all. Your sister has great ideas. Here. Gracie, are you done? Oh my god! Hey, you know you guys can invite all your friends to her party. I'm turning sixteen Girl. soon, and my brother's turning eighteen. So those are like no, really, milestone no. birthdays. I don't think we're gonna get a party this big, you know? It's kinda crazy, cause my sister's turning six. Yeah, that is crazy, all right? So obviously these parents are filthy rich. They can throw a decent birthday party for their six-year-old. It doesn't have to be $30,000 worth. Save that for the 16-year-old or 18-year-old, or just save it for a vacation or something, not just a single day birthday party. You could do so much more with that money, like for real. But if they are seriously set on spending $30,000 on a birthday party for some weird freaking reason then i mean the least you can do with this ridiculous standard that you've set for yourself you could spend it on the 16 year old's birthday party or the 18 year old's birthday party like there is no reason for you to do it for the six year old who's not going to remember a single thing at all it's so stupid or, or what are you thinking i don't uh, uh, just throw it out there about 10 grand maybe what 10 grand you're psycho. Little did they know, the 10 grand was only a third of what she was gonna spend for her little girl's birthday party. <laughs> this is so stupid. How is this real right now? Donate money to charity or something, dude. Not this crap. I don't think the best things in life come with having a large party. This is crazy. She's been a little special gift to me she in my life. She's special to me too, honey. It's okay, you don't have to get upset. I'm just trying to keep things with I mean. Reason. I want to capture this moment, and I'm afraid that if we don't do it right now, when she's six, then okay, it's well, going to go away. Oh, so it's not even about the girl. It's about the mom wanting to capture a moment with her daughter. Why not just take her to Disney World or something then? Why do you have to spend $30,000 on a birthday party? Like, seriously, take her on a nice vacation. Like, why are you spending all this money for a one single day birthday party, all right? She's saying that she wants to capture her in this, like, fairy tale world or whatever. Seriously, if she takes her to Disney, you know, they have some money to spend so they can do the expensive stuff there, like go to Cinderella's castle, all that stuff. She will 
feel like she is in a fairy tale like she's literally in Cinderella the movie like that will happen you don't need to spend all this money on a single day birthday party like take her on a vacation that lasts a couple days maybe she'll actually remember some of it then because it's lasting longer than just a single day I mean obviously these parents don't have any common sense right but like come on just think for a second about what you're doing here Suzanne led a dozen workers to do 45 centerpieces 2,000 flowers 300 costumes all to accommodate 250 guests like what do they actually need all this stuff for seriously why why do you have all these centerpieces all these costumes all these decorations like nobody cares about that nobody's gonna be looking at every single little centerpiece and decoration and be like oh wow that's so cool especially not the person that you're throwing the birthday party for who's literally six years old she's just gonna like be wearing her costume or whatever and eating some cake and dancing and listening to music or something like it's not about all the decorations and all the centerpieces like nobody cares about that dude no one it's just sad to see because it's literally like they're burning money like this is just the biggest waste of money I've ever seen that was rude when I got here it was quite stressful because I think there was a miscommunication with Suzanne the kids activities yeah right there Oh, so we've changed it? I come in there and the buffet table is in the center of where everyone will be dancing. Can we, um, well, I, it was supposed to be in here, but I guess... I guess there was just a major misunderstanding. Can we move this? right there why is this like the most dramatic thing ever the buffet table was in the wrong spot oh <gasps> i know it's so scary guys i am so spooked from this this is one of the scariest moments i've ever seen in any video ever it just moved the buffet table it's not a big deal it doesn't have to be this whole dramatic thing <laughs> like what it's down the deal. Are you for real? it looks fine oh my gosh Nicole wants me to dress as King Louis the, is it the 14th, 13th, one of those kings. Anyways, I gotta dress up like a king. Oh, no, 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 I'm not doing that. I'm not wearing a wig. Do I have to wear a wig? Why don't we smooth this down and then have it sit more on the top? Okay, seriously, what kind of life choices do you have to make in your life to end up right here? This guy right here was well off, right? I'm sure that he was very, very rich. And the person that he married is making him do stuff like this, spend $30,000 of his hard-earned cash on his six-year-old daughter's birthday party. Like, this is so ridiculous. Like, obviously, he doesn't want to be here. Like, I, I feel bad for the dude at this point. I really do. I guess I'm broke. 15 minutes before Gracie's grand entrance. I hadn't even got my dress on yet. People are lining up outside and there is just so many problems. Gracie's playing with her cousins right now so she does not want to get ready at all. Gracie, oh, no. stop. You had stop in there, please. No. It was crazy because Gracie would not let anyone else get her dressed. I hear I hire these hairdressers and makeup artists and she would not do anything but she just wanted her mommy you know maybe you wouldn't have this problem arise if you threw the birthday party for someone a little bit older who actually knows what's going on and isn't just like a kid that likes to run around and stuff like that like i seriously still have yet to understand what these parents are expecting all of our guests were ready and they were patiently waiting for gracie <laughs> And after a day of pulling off miracle after miracle, the fairy tale finally began. Hey, this is actually ridiculous. They have a full carriage and everything. Like, what? Like, all of this right now. All of this that you're seeing for a six year old girl, over $30,000 spent. Just let that sink in, dude. Let that sink in. Whenever I was six, you know what my birthday party was? I went to Chuck E. Cheese and I probably got $5 worth of tokens to spend. And I ate some really crappy pizza. Uh, you know, but I still had the time of my life. I had a great six year old birthday party. It was amazing for me. Like, I didn't need all of this. This. Nobody at any age needs all of this, let alone someone who is six years old. Hello, Seeing the children in costume, it was just so fun to see them, you know, kind of take on their character. They were all living a fantasy. It was just magical. If you want your dreams to come true, you must close your eyes real tight and think and hope and wish and dream and maybe they'll come true. It 
was fabulous. The dancers, the caterers, the costumes, and Gracie just having a ball. Well, I guess you can say money well s not spent. Money spent not well at all. That was terribly spent. Gracie is a little bit of a perfectionist like her mother. And when it came out, she was like, I thought the bird was supposed to be blue. And so she started to cry. The birthday balloon went flat for a minute. She just wanted everything to be perfect like her mom. I, I still can't believe this, right? $30,000 spent and one little imperfection like this, a purple bird instead of a blue bird just ruins it all. Like literally makes this girl ball her eyes out. Like, these parents must feel so freaking stupid right now. They spent $30,000 to make her have the best day of her life. It was supposed to be magical, you know? She's supposed to be happy the whole entire time. But yet, she still isn't happy. Like, oh my god, what a waste of money. I mean, obviously it's a waste of money, but it's an even bigger waste of money now, dude. And then, it, here came the unveiling of our big large gift. One, two, three. Well, um, that was her present. She got a brand new car at the age of six and she doesn't even know how to drive. So, uh, that's really cool. Once again, money really well spent, guys. Just genius stuff from the parents here. They're very, very good at budgeting their money. They, they only spend it on the important stuff. Obviously not, guys. That was too much stupid for me today. Huge shout out to my channel members, Ace One and Ace for being the Patrick tier, as well as Slowly String for being the SpongeBob tier. If you guys do want to see some more of my content, just click one of those thingies up on the screen. And, uh, yeah. Bye!